So internally, from, from a, a selfish corporate perspective, we have a, 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 an unending thirst for benchmark data. Obviously, based on what we do, we, we know about third-party spend, contracts, uh, performance levels, uh, supply chain risks, and so on and so forth. And we bring that to the table as part of our, our service portfolio. That said, we are constantly trying to seek out other third-party benchmark data to append to what we have to enhance some of the models. And why do we have to do that? Because our customers expect us to bring them, you know, best, you know, good service at the right cost, the right quality, with the right innovation, you know, the right assurance of supply. And uh, in order for us to do that, we just, you know, have to ensure we have a, a dearth of, uh, of benchmark data, our own plus whatever we can find. So that's that's the internal perspective. The external perspective is, you know, given that we are a, uh, a, a we are in the midst of a many-to-many -many relationship, right? So you have our clients, you have Chain IQ, and on the other side you have our client suppliers. We have a massive amount of intelligence, whether that be uh, price, preference, cost, alternative, substitutes, you name it, it runs the gamut. And in that unique position, each of our customers have a keen interest in understanding what our other customers are doing, obviously, and of course this is all uh, part and parcel to what, uh, uh, what we can share, you know, as agreed with our customers. But then also, too, on the supply side, every one of those suppliers that we're engaging with and touching, they have a desire to understand, hey, how am I doing against my competitor? Hey, is there more opportunity for me with my existing client? What about the other clients that you're serving? You know, can I, can I, can I get in there as well? So they want a benchmark. Uh, there's also a unique thing sort of emerging as well where uh, there's, we're having some discussion around can the totality of the data that, that we pick up in our operations uh, uh, feed something else, like perhaps a, a new type of purchasing index, you know, one that's much more rich than, you know, some of the traditional indices that are out there that are used in, uh, you know, economic forecasts and so on and so forth.